outstanding educator, a man of vision and courageous leadership. He is one who is unafraid of making difficult decisions and taking risks to ensure the academic excellence of the college and to provide significant institutional contribution to the economic development of Western Massachusetts and the entire Commonwealth. Dr. Chevelli's visionary efforts have received national acclaim on many levels. For example, he was elected to the Board of Directors of the American Association of Community Colleges in Washington, D.C. He is often a speaker at many national conferences. He also serves on the host of the boards of civic, charitable, and educational organizations and has received many honors and awards, all richly deserved. Ladies and gentlemen, I present our president, Andrew Chanel. Tonight. And I have to tell you, they did it 
and great decorum. They did it before the ceremony and they absolutely refused to interrupt the ceremony because they have so much respect for our students and their accomplishments. Kudos to you for having the class that you do. I want to mention that seven of those faculty and staff have announced their retirement this year, and we're going to miss them, we're going to miss them a lot. Meg Bellucci, John Bugney, Jim Dowd, Mitch Gregorski, Alan Peck, Lee Tuttle, and Edith Wiles, God bless you and care for you. If the governor were here, we would also see something about economic vitality in the Pioneer Valley and how you, the graduates, contribute to that. They talk about the fact that there's a brain drain, that students who graduate from colleges leave the area. When it comes to this college, the brains stay right here. So if the governor came here tonight, you people would get the diplomas, and he would get the education.
Michelle Hilda, who I meet is graduating from respiratory care, represented her class in the health sciences pinning ceremony last week. She could barely get through her speech. She was overcome by so much emotion at having gone out over obstacles and finally fulfilling her dream. Another graduate I'd like to recognize is Shannon Pavlov. She left high school early and spent several years in a variety of not very really exciting jobs. When she became pregnant, she realized that she couldn't bring a child into this world and provide for it by continuing what she was doing. She came to SDCC as a mechanical engineering technology student and applied herself from day one. She took as many as 24 credits a semester. She tutored students as part of her work as a Saturday lab tech in the CAD CAM labs. She is the 2003 recipient of the Mechanical Engineering Technology Faculty Award and more importantly is now employed as a quality assurance technician at EdSource. Her son is three and a half years old and his future looks much brighter now. <laughs> Wei Yun Winnie Chen will be taking a different kind of exam this summer, a naturalization exam for citizenship. She and her family are from Taiwan and came to this country a few years ago. She works at her family's restaurant in Northampton and also tutors in chemistry. Next fall, she'll be in the microbiology department at UMass. Laurie Pio Cole. She got married just before her husband was assigned to active duty in Kuwait last fall. That left her to care for her young daughter by herself and made attending her degree in physical therapy assistant program that much more challenging. But she persevered. Now her husband is back from the Middle East and she's anxious to start her career. And I'd like to conclude with the story of Christian Lally, whose story of perseverance and expending the extra effort to finish what he started is truly uplifting. Christian didn't let the fact that he had cerebral palsy keep him from achieving his goal of earning a degree in liberal arts class. Paul. He's now continuing that journey at Westfield State College where he's a psychology major. Christian says, having a handicap motivates me more and helps me to strive to things beyond my reach. Coming to STCC and having the privilege of learning and growing with such wonderful faculty and staff was extremely positive in my life. Looking back, the two years that I spent at STCC were by far the best years of my life. Christian's goal is to earn a master's degree and be a counselor, and I'll know he'll become one, because once he sets his mind to doing something, he does it. And folks, there's hundreds of stories like that in this audience right in front of us. And let me just say one word that sums all these stories up. Inspiring. You and your families, friends and faculty members should all be very proud of what you've accomplished. Congratulations on everything that you have accomplished. May God bless you and keep you well. Thank you. Okay, are you ready? Uh, I was kind of half-hearted. I think we're going to have some more speakers if that's all you're going to have. Very good. It is now my honor to present the class of 2003. Stevens, and members of the Board of Trustees on behalf of the faculty of the college, I am pleased to present 165 candidates for the degree of Associate of Arts, 534 candidates for the degree of Associate of Science, 24 candidates for the degree of Associate of Applied Science, and 44 candidates for certificates, and 103 candidates for certificates of completion. And the entire graduating class, please rise.
decision, and those candidates who are judging the college have successfully met the requirements for graduation. Talk to me. Oh, I know. <laughs> to my graduation party is uh, June 15th, Father's Day, and my anniversary for my parents. So that's Happy Father's Day, Dad. And that's working okay then? Uh, oh, I'm hoping I'll have another one of these in two to three years. So, uh, so what's the latest? Keep in tune. We gotta go to the doctor next time. <laughs> and that's all, folks. Fridge. I'm going to videotape you guys getting ready, okay? What's that? I'm videotaping you. Say hi to Dave. Happy graduation, Dave. We're proud of you. Okay. All this food is looking yummy and I'm hungry. Say hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. Say hi, Mom. Whatever. Busy as bees, preparing artistically. You have to say hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. Turner. Turner even has the school colors on. You're supposed to say Happy Father's Day. I have a card for you. Huh? A card for you. And Happy Anniversary. Three things in one day. That's too much. Yeah. 
Hi. Uh, you're on, hi. You're on TV. Happy graduation. Hi. Happy graduation, David. David. Don't do anything <laughs> stupid. <laughs> well, <That'd be> nice. <laughs> he's gonna watch us in ten don't, years. And... Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Yeah. Oh boy, that leaves a lot, huh? <laughs> well, good luck. You're gonna need it. <laughs> okay. You're on candid camera, Wayne. Where? You have to talk. Not where? Is that to David. on? Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not. David's yes, right there. Yes, it is. Happy you congratulations, have to... David. There you go. So he can see this 20 years from now. 20 years from now? Maybe. Yeah, well, hopefully I'll still be alive then. <laughs> so well, maybe I'll uh, yeah. say it then. Okay, because, that sounds uh, good. I'm not prepared to say anything. I don't have any comments prepared for this okay. event today. All right, we'll catch but, you in 20 years then. Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. Oh, did it? Is it on? Yes. What did I say? To Talk to David. I don't know. Tell him something. <laughs> this is the actress here on stage who, who's speechless. <laughs> Hi, David. <laughs> Bye. Say congratulations. Congratulations. You're David. <laughs> Watch your mother. Your mother can say something. David, I want to say congratulations and uh, just to let you know, now you're going to have to be like the rest of us poor slobs and get up at 6.15 in the morning. So, good luck with that. Yeah. He's a Yeah. I wonder why. Hi. Hi. Hey. Talk to David. Say huh? something about David to uh, the camera for his video. He's my nephew who just graduated. That's very nice for you to say to him. I still find it hard to believe. You he's do? not hearing me. He's supposed to be overhearing that. No, oh, that's because he's going to watch this later. Uh. The talk. Yep. That's the newest father in the group. you got to say something to David. Say something to David? Yeah, this is a tape for him. Happy graduation, Dave. Happy graduation. I was going to ask him to do the blessing, but... Yeah, really. Um, I'm off the clock. <laughs> never, never off the clock. But anyways, uh, there's a basket then to the picnic table for cards or whatever. And there's also a book there you can sign and, and put some words of wisdom in there for David. Yes, he needs lots whatever. of words of wisdom. Yeah, so if you lots. wanted to do that. Uh, have a lot of good food here, so. Now, Pastor Jeff, you want to say the blessing? Well, you want me to? Yeah, really. Okay, sure. All right, let's pray. Hey, Lord, thanks so much for this occasion for David. Really, mm -hmm. we just thank you and, and are blessed by the perseverance that he's shown and, and how you've given him all that he's needed as he's taken those steps. And thanks for uh, the whites and their hospitality. Now, Lord, just bless the food. We're, we're grateful for it. We don't take that for granted, but especially our being together. Mm -hmm. May we come away encouraged and more, just more appreciative of you. So do that, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Can you cut me a piece? Wait a second. You're not videoing me, are you? No, David. Where is David? Straight ahead of me. You just walked into it, though. No, you can go now. Hey, Dave. You're a good guy. You got a long road ahead. This is step one. Step kids one. out there are going to need you. You want to count some? You're going to count a lot of kids, man. Good luck, man. You got a long road to go. You ready? You ready? We're moving over. It's your turn. <laughs> Hey Dave, what can I say? <laughs> what can I say? Well, hey brother, I love you, and I hope that you do something with that skill that you have, with that craft, with your cartoons. You say, what skill does he have? No. Yes, he's very good at it. With the yes, art he graphics. is. So I want to see him use that gift that God's given him. Maybe even to use that. Well, gadget. Go for it, bro. <laughs> Use it. <laughs> Wi-Fi again. Let him go. What's that? Ooh, do I see the lemon? We're going over. We're going oh, over. Oh. It's your turn. Oh, uh, 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 uh. uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, David's, um, he's all right. He's a pretty good guy. He's, uh, loving, caring. Um, 
top-notch Christian uh, and kind of squirrely. <laughs> What's squirrely mean? <laughs> Climbs trees. <laughs> He's just kind of David. It's a baby. The best explanation is David is David. David David. Okay. Yeah. I don't know what else to say. You can say bye now. I'm going to turn it off. Huh? You can say bye. I'm going to turn it off. Bye. Bye to kid. The closing. Yeah. The buyers of our buyers. I am. Yeah, you're on. I am. Yeah. Should I give you all my faces? Lawyer. Yeah. David. I'm gonna watch this later. Huh? David's gonna watch this later. Yeah. yeah. What do you think about that, Dave? What do you think about that, Dave? How are you feeling today, Dave? How's it feel to be a college graduate? Uh, super silly. What? For what? Super silly. Super silly. Oh, is that a new word? He's a dumb lawyer. He is. Okay. We don't like him. Look cool with those shades on, Dave. He's actually a pretty good guy. They cover up my irritated eye. He what? I got irritated from the contact. Yeah, he did. Okay. I'll take this off now. Wait a minute. Go ahead. First man. Say hi, Uncle Dave. Congratulations on he come in college. You know, six times a week. <laughs> we love you. We did closing out our first house, which was a lot easier than this, these two. Yay! Yeah, we really do love you, Dave. Yay! Yay! Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Oh. Yay! Hey, Melanie. Yeah. You don't have no choice to love him. You're married into the family. I know. I have no choice. <laughs> so That's not why. Yeah. Yeah. You want to take a picture? What are you going to say to David? Thank you, David. Like oh, that's good. Cheese. 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 I'm going to take a picture of the cake now. David, you going to stand with your cake? Take me with the caterpillar, too. Caterpillar? Whoa. Well, stand with your cake, Dave. Do you have my caterpillar now? Oh, can I have cake? As soon as it's cut, you gotta wait a minute. Oh, hold on, Dave. I don't got that in the picture. You gotta get a little lower for that. <laughs> David is hungry. Hey, Dave, are you gonna cut that cake? Here, just just pose with the knife like you're gonna cut it. Or something. The bonsai, just like set in there. At last. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, look up, David. How about me? Give me a nice picture. I got you in the picture. You're right in the picture. You want to see something, Jillian? Come here. There's more than one way to it. Hey, all right. Do you see the picture? Cool. You see it? Oh, perfect. Do you see you? Oh my goodness! I'm I'm doing me days. Watch out! I'm gonna cut this end. Oh, there we go. Ready for me now? <laughs> there you go, Dave. You cut it. Good job. David is learning how to cut a cake. Right. You'll be an expert in all time. Dig in, Dave. Would you like to watch yourself while you do it? No. Yeah, I do. Let me see okay. myself. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let me take a more distinctive pose here. <laughs> I'm such a ravishing, ravishingly good looking mother. We're going to edit that out. Of 41. <laughs> David, you're doing a great job. Otherwise, Dad cutting your cake, David. David tried to cut the cake, job. but. Did I fail in my efforts? At, you got to tip it. Too much, there's too much head space here. No, no, you made me <laughs> cover it off. <laughs> okay, okay, am I even now? Yes. Okay. So, we're going to have cake. You can't, just remember one thing, David, one more hey, wisdom. You can't have your cake and eat it, it too. Oh. Figure it out for yourself, but it's true. Thank you. Dave James